Hello everyone and welcome back. Today's video is going to show you how to roll back your NVIDIA GPU drivers if you're experiencing blue screens, stuttering, uh, frame drops, or if you just have a, another version that you prefer you felt like it was more stable. Please be sure to follow the video so you don't end up with any other problems and watch to the end because I'm going to share some NVIDIA control panel settings with you that you might forget or they might not know about. So let's go ahead and get started. First we're going to open Revo Uninstaller. I like to use that for a thorough cleanup and I'll leave a link for that down in the description. We're going to find the NVIDIA graphics driver here, right click uninstall. Continue, it's going to create a system restore point. And ask if we really want to remove it, yes we're going to click uninstall. After it does that, then it's going to ask if you want to restart. You are not going to do that, you will click restart later, we'll do that in just a second. And you're going to come here and click advanced after you click advanced click scan we're going to click select all it's going to find any residual files that were left behind from the driver then click delete after we do that then we're going to go ahead and restart our computer while we're waiting on that if you're finding this video easy to follow if you're finding it useful then do me a favor leave a like down below and consider subscribing to the channel it lets me know to bring you more content like this if you are already subscribed to the channel thank you so much for your continued support now that we've restarted let's go ahead and get our driver version that we want we're going to open up our browser and in search we want to type nvidia driver search click download the official nvidia drivers go to manual driver search we're going to make sure we're on GeForce and in some of you guys cases it'll vary in my case I'm on the 50 series process is the same either way make sure you got your operating system and your language we're going to click find then we're going to go down to view more versions and for the people on 30 and 40 series that are having problems after the recent update, you're going to look for 566.36. And when you find that, you're going to click on View. And then Download. Once that's complete, you're going to open that up. I'm going to want to run that. Click Yes and OK. Wait for that to reinstall or install. And once that's done installing, it's going to restart again. And again, if you guys have found this video useful, do me a favor, leave a like, consider subscribing to the channel, and hopefully we'll see you in the next one.